Hey everybody out there, my name is Chris Nicholson. I'm a honky tonk ragtime boogie woogie pianist. And also, I am a Williams piano artist. So, I would love to announce today that Williams actually has a brand new digital grand piano. Since the holiday season is here, and also Christmas is right around the corner, and we have a new year coming up, guess what I'd like to introduce? Williams has the brand new Symphony Concert Grand. So, if you already seen my video of the Williams Symphony Grand 2, this is a bigger upgrade. Okay, so now it's been a full year since I actually announced the release of the Symphony Grand 2. And as you know, and you can go back to the video that I have actually posted on YouTube of the Symphony Grand 2, it is a marvelous instrument. And now, for its bigger brother, the Symphony Concert, it has much more of a bigger profile. It's a bigger grand piano profile. Um, on the lid, you actually have two pieces instead of one piece. So you have the head and the tail, which the head actually flips over, and you can have the music desk come from outside and actually stand up. Now, as you're looking at the pictures of the symphony concert, you can see it's a much more bigger piano, which means that we have added a lot more bigger features. First of all, when you open up the fall board of the symphony concert, you have actually a two-step fall board that can actually hide the controls so you don't actually see the controls of the piano. You could just say it looks just like a real piano. Also, when you flip up the other part of the fall board, you have a beautiful color LCD display that is actually a touchscreen. So this is our very first touchscreen color LCD display. Very user friendly, everything is right in front of you and all of it is just basically a touch of the display. So now let's talk about the action of the Symphony Concert. You get a more upgraded action. Then the Symphony Grand 2 actually had the Fatara Grand Touch action. This you actually have the Fatara Graded Hammer action, which is a little bit more response. And so the left hand side of the piano is going to be a lot heavier than the right hand side of the piano. All naturally scaled from the bass all the way up to the treble. On top of that, right above the keys, you have a multicolored LED, uh, basically guide lamps right on top of there. So the guide lamps is also for educational. If you want to learn how to play piano, you can le learn piano by using Scove app. And also, if you're just doing something to record multi-timbral, like your tracks, you can actually see them in multi-different colors. So the drums could be in orange, and the piano could be in a blue. Different colors how you have them. So we talked about the profile of the symphony concert and also we talked about the action. We talked about most of the added features of the profile of the symphony concert. So now I would like to talk about the piano sound. The piano sound is a little bit more upgraded than the symphony grand too. And also it's a two gig full piano sound with six different layers on it. So once you press like the pianissimo, and basically go all the way up to the fortissimo, you actually hear the cross switching of the samples, which is good. You also have an unlooped 88 key sample of one of the finest Italian made 10 foot concert grand pianos. So now the amplifier of the symphony concert, you actually have eight speakers. You have two woofers on the bottom. You also have two mid ranges from the performer view and on top you actually have four tweeters. So you have regular mid-range tweeters and you have the soprano tweeters. On top of that, remember, you're dealing with a bigger, bigger cabinet, so you have more of a different sound than the Symphony Grand 2. Another feature that you have is underneath, you have two eight-inch headphone jacks. So you and a student can actually listen to the Symphony Grand in private, even if you're doing piano lessons, if you live in an apartment, everything could be actually on headphones. So, you also have two USBs, which is one is to host, which is actually your, um, your USB devices. So if you want to store your MP3s or your MIDI files or your compositions, you can actually do that. And also right behind the uh, music desk, you have the USB to device, plus an eight inch 
line end, which is really cool. Now everybody, I am so proud to say, with the new Williams Symphony concert out, I was definitely in collaboration with this model, this beautiful piano. Um, I will be receiving one, as I was just informed on my email, and once I get it, of course, I'm going to make a video of it. Now, what I was in collaboration was, is basically the styles. So, just like on a Symphony Grand 2, you get to actually have the same accompaniment styles. So, as I said again, interactive styles. Once you press a major chord, it's just going to be the normal style. Then when you press a minor chord, it's going to be a little bit different with the chord variations. And then once you press a seventh chord, it's actually going to get more excited. And these styles are interactive. So they get to follow you no matter what and definitely with the chord changes. On top of that, you have an intro, you have an ending, you have two variations and two fillings. And also you have a fade out. The Symphony Concert, just like the Symphony Grand 2, comes with 172 custom voices. Now, what I mean by custom voices is that, remember what I was talking about, Williams actually has their own sample library. No, there was a rumor that basically that we were from another company. No, we are actually our own company and we have our own samples. So, as with that two gig piano sound, you have an extra 171 more sounds. So you have more guitars, basses, you have actually synthesizers, and also you have drums. You have everything, all the bread and butter sounds to make your own arrangements and accompaniments. Now, I think that's very, very exciting. On top of that, if you look also on the right-hand side of the keyboard's layout, you can actually see eight different drum pads. And those eight different drum pads, if you wanted to actually um, play them while you're recording, or basically, you can I think you can assign the drum pads for sure. I'm not for sure, but I think you can. Now, if you basically want to hook up a computer to it, as I said, the USB jack is actually in the back of the music press. You have 256 note polyphony, so you'll never ever run out of polyphony, which is very good. It comes in handy when you're doing musical compositions. On top of that, once you open up the lid, you can actually see a beautiful soundboard with the matching speaker grill. So everything is matching, not out of place. It looks very, very beautiful in your home. I am truly, truly excited. I can't wait until I get this model home here. So right now, I have the whole Williams line. I actually have the Legato 3, the Allegro 3, which is a step up, and also I have the Rhapsody 3. On top of that, I have the Overture 3. I have the Symphony Grand 2. And now, which is on its way, I can say Merry Christmas is the Symphony Concert. So once I get the Symphony Concert, of course, I'm going to be making some videos. I have the whole line. So if you have any questions and anything that you'd like me to review on the Symphony Concert or any of the Williams products, you're welcome to shoot me basically a message on YouTube, Facebook, or my email, which is Chris Nicholson, K R I S N I C H O L S O N 24 at yahoo.com. So, what I urge you guys to do is basically go onto the Williams website, which is www.williamspianos.com, and you can see actually the whole line. And also, if you join me on the Facebook page, which is actually the William Piano Artist Forums. If you have a Williams product, it could be an old one, it could be a new one. All you have to do is post a picture of it, post videos, tell us how you like it, tell us what needs improving, tell us what we can do in the future of future keyboards. Believe me, we are listening. So everybody, I would like to say to you, thank you so much for watching this video. Happy holidays and have a blessed new year. Thank you.